Brothers and sisters, what's going on, Brother Wisdom? All right, this is going to be part two of Supercell. All right, um, Brother Marvin gave us a great uh, introduction on Supercell. All right, if you all have seen this movie, Supercell, you, it's, it's a lot that you need to understand. I would love to put some, you know, improvisions in here and some video highlights and whatever else, but... You know, we're dealing with these uh, white folk on our planet using our internet, you know, creating an unbalanced system where they try to control what we say and what we can't say. So, you know, it's kind of like, you know, kind of fucked up right now, but we're going to get through this here. All right. The whole point of Supercell is, um, like I said at the very end of that last video, was that... Um, there are so many of our people who are, you know, they're just walking around every day and they don't know that they have what you call superior powers within them. All right. They don't know that they have superior powers within them. And what 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 is going on here is the fact that they say, well, you know, sickle cell. Well, you got to understand the, the cold words in sickle cell which means broken bloodline, all right? Broken bloodline. So when we got, what we what we understanding is that when we begin to regenerate the bloodline of our ancestors and we come in, in alignment, there's a power that comes upon us. And the thing about this power here is, it's not something that we're necessarily used to, all right? It's not something that we're necessarily used to that we're used to doing on a daily basis and it kind of like catches us by surprise. You know, I'm pretty sure the brothers and sisters who uh, were out there with the hydrokinesis and pyrokinesis and they it, it shocked the fuck out of them. Like, I can make water move, you know. I wave my hands across the water and that just the water just begins to ripple all across the surface of the water and other things begins to happen. So when we begin to heal the bloodline and this is all through your meditation this is all through balancing your bodies balancing your chakras when you have doubt you have fear when you have shame all right when you have sadness because you lost someone or something all right frustration unnatural anger when you're just angry and you want you know when you have that thing of vengeance and I want to pay somebody back all these unnatural emotions begin to cause your body not to be in balance and you know the whole part of like like brother Marvin Jones say you know Chi God I like I like his his name Chi God like Chi God said um we it's it's right here in your solar plexus area all right that fire energy that fire energy so when you start talking about that fire energy you start talking about um extremely uh you can run the speed of light you can um uh levitate and fly you can make things move with your with your hands, you know, with your mind, you can teleport from one place to another place. All right, you you have the um, ability to make lightning come from your body. You know, it's it's all different types of things. So, Supercell was literally, um, uh, I would I would say that Supercell was an, was an offset on uh, X Men, but what it did was it showed our powers as showed us as the original beings then there was also a mixed individual he his mother was white and his dad was um what so-called black um but he did because he carried that gene all right and they're showing that yeah those who carry the gene can also you know but the gene cannot be inserted through laboratory you know on a, on a laboratory basis it has to be through um genetics you know, which means that you you know you pushing yourself inside of another person's and creating an individual um so um 
the whole point of supercell is for us to understand that we have hidden powers within us and it's important that we as the original beings begin to gravitate towards bringing ourselves back into this absolute balance this absolute energy this absolute power all right this power belongs to us brothers and sisters it really does it, it belongs to us um one thing i saw was that um i did that one in the last video i did that one part with um where billy carson was was talking about the different crystals and for each one of us as the original beings you know we under this calendar system we are able to link into different um astrological or star systems you know we can link into the Taurus star system the capricorn the virgo the cancer you know the um the libra we can link, link into these different star systems and there is a crystal and I, and I showed that one part there's a crystal for that's designed for the for the star system the solar so the solar plexus of each star system all right i'm to be honest i'll probably collect all the crystals every one of them that's that that belongs to the different star systems and just be like you know what because we're nature we're the cosmos who say that we belong to one star system when we have the entire cosmic order within us so i'll get all of them i wouldn't care I'd get them get them all and be like <laughs> you know charge my solar plexus all the way up but the key in this is here is, is understanding that we have an enemy who's watching us and this enemy is watching us closely all right just what we talked about 1875 we're doing what they call the Carrington event when so many brothers and sisters has secretly awakened and the energy from our bodies have literally caused an influx of solar energy to hit the planet and destroy everything. And this is what's happening now. Why you think they trying to get everybody ready for war? They want to war against us, and like we said in the eight in in the, in the mid eighteen hundreds era era, which a lot of history is hidden. All right, we knew that there were a lot of things that happened. They took over a lot of our communities and all because they had to pinpoint where the power was coming from, where the celestial power was coming from, and we are tapping into ourselves and. The hidden information in the mid 1800s was the fact that they had went to war against us to make us fall back into a deep sleep state. All right. They needed us to fall back into this deep sleep state because this was the only way that they could survive. And they said, we got to destroy that which is causing our system to fall or what's causing us to die. All right. Now that we have this whole internet system here that's that's all set up that actually had already been in existence, just telling you guys, the, the internet never went anywhere. We it's always been in existence. All right, it's just don't think you know these these whites are so dumb to 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 to, to try to think make us think that oh this is a new thing. The internet the internet has always been here. We've always been communicating on a higher level. The internet is just a way of connecting us to uh, different areas. Just that. Uh, as the original people, we haven't um, we haven't tapped into the system that will allow us as the original beings to use different radio frequencies because there are different radio frequencies that we can use where we can communicate um, at home and abroad, which means that right now we're communicating at home. But we have radio systems, these radio uh, uh, frequencies, you know, when you when you go above 107.5, I guess, because I think 107.5 is about the highest that you can go uh, with these with this uh, white people. This, the system that they create, 107.5 is the highest you can go. When you, when you start going into the uh, radio frequency uh, 220, 
225, 250, uh, radio frequency 330, uh, even radio frequency 333. When you start going to these higher radio frequencies, you're starting to deal with higher uh, levels of radiation, higher levels of, of, of power. And this is why, you know, that we talked about the chanting to increase our levels of intelligence because the chanting is literally going to allow us to uh, 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 link into that extra powerful vibrational energy where we will be able to create our own radio technology because technology is, is, is a part of our uh, original physiological process uh, of bodies as well. All right. So, in this instance, brothers and sisters, the supercell is like Brother Marvin Jones says, this is all linked into your solar plexus. And this is why we have all the foods out here that are designed to destroy the chakra energies of our bodies. All right. You look at the chips, you look at the drinks, you look at the candies, uh, all the different meats on the shelf. And those things are like extremely inexpensive, literally. But when you start getting into the real deal, when you start getting into the organic foods and the organic fruits and organic vegetables, that shit costs money. And we shouldn't have to be paying for anything. All right. We shouldn't have to be paying for anything. This is why I urge brothers and sisters to begin, you know, get, getting into yourself and furnishing yourself with this extremely powerful knowledge so that you can create um i was talking to my son and that you know was just talking about supercell with my son and i said i told my son i said you know if you had the power to fly there'd be no need for a car or a plane and i told him, i said if you had the power to move faster than the speed of light there would be no need for a car i said if you had the power to teleport from one place to another there'll be no need for a car I said if you had the power to um, literally create gateways and, and portals I was like there'll be no need for a car and he said you know what he said that makes a lot of sense I said yeah that makes a lot of sense so you got to understand that you're talking about the original people our chakra system, our bodies, the powers that are within us, and these are hidden powers that we have to bring to life. And we change the entire atmosphere, which we, which is what we're doing right now. We have a whole enemy now who's watching everything we do. This is a whole part of Supercell because they showed us these are white folk watching us through the camera system, all right? Which means they're letting us know that, yeah, we're watching you. And they, you have so many brothers and sisters who have tapped into this power or have done something extraordinary and didn't know what they were doing. And all of a sudden they come missing. And where are they? In some abandoned building complex or some underground system. All right. Locked up in a cage somewhere. All right. And these beings are using their powers. Have you ever seen Project Power with Jamie Foxx? Because Brother Marvin Jones, she got, had mentioned that. Have you ever seen Project Power? What, what, what happened with that was that Jamie Foxx's daughter and Jamie Foxx himself had these extremely powerful uh, abilities. And um, they had her daughter, I mean, I'm sorry, her daughter. They had his daughter in the movie hooked up to all these probes and whatever else and 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 taking her blood and all that uh to be able to to try to create what you call super soldiers and this is what they want to do they want to create super soldiers they want to be a part of this they want they they literally want to be a part of this system but they want to control everything all right and this is why we talked about you know, telling brothers, talking about brothers and sisters need to awaken. And if you only knew the powers that are with that were within you, you would not have to go through the suffering and pains that so many of our brothers and sisters have gone through dealing with this unjust police system. All right. Dealing with this unjust police system, dealing with this unjust so-called justice system. All right. Because 
you would literally begin to destroy everything around you with the energy within you. And this is the whole part. So the super cell is an energy that's within us. Connect like Brother Barbara Jones said, Brother Chi God. I like Chi God. I like that Chi God. Brother Marvin, you were right. I like Chi God. And like I said, it's, it's all tied into your solar plexus. All right. We did a short scene with Dragon Ball Z showing how to breathe. You know, your solar plexus area is the most powerful what one of the most powerful areas in your body because all of your chakras are extremely powerful all right there's not there's 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 not one chakra that is more powerful than the other chakra they balance each other out and to be balanced mean balance literally means the equal they equal themselves out but it all begins with here and your heart your mind the heart and your soul all right so they want to they're watching us and they want to control what we have like they told the one guy andre they say you know well they they caught andre because um he had like the super strength you know he hit this brick wall at the atm and all the money came out of the atm you know he started practicing and he thought he was doing it in, in in private and they were watching him on camera they had cameras everywhere that's why they got cameras everywhere y'all because it's not so much to watch the shit that's going on they want to watch us they want to watch us they they have they have this need to watch us because they want to act like they are our parents and they and what they want to act like they can uh, 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 are the ones to control our abilities and our powers and our energies or whatever else and we can't we can no longer tolerate such foolishness brothers and sisters we can no longer tolerate such foolishness so the whole point of the super cell is understanding that you know, like 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 chi god says it's, it's only one cell what is that the solar plexus so it's all about you balancing yourself out and it's all about you um your thoughts i'm all powerful i am almighty i am the omnipotent i am the everything you know and when you, whenever you walk into a place, everything begins to balance itself out the way it's supposed to to balance itself out. But that's all about the supercell. You know, they're watching us, but it's that dormant powers that's within you that you don't know is there. Every being, especially the beings of melanin, there's a dormant power within us. Like I said, you know, you got the food, the the, the candy industry, you got the chip industry, you got the cake industry. You got the uh, uh, bread industry. You got the the soda industry. You got these juice drink. They're juice drinks, not juice. Juice drinks. So many brothers and sisters get tricked. Thing I'm getting drinking juice, and you're drinking juice drink, which is a little bit of juice, maybe five or ten percent of, of juice, and the rest of it is chemicals. You know, you got that fantasy that that tropical fantasy which is a drink and it and, and they say oh yeah this is fruit punch and this is apple juice and then when you look at the back of this whole thing it's like it's filled with all these dangerous chemicals all right that can in in the raw form can kill you dead but it's, it's, it's watered down with a bunch of water in there too all right no natural flavors no nothing no real juice just all chemicals to make you, you know, to to trick the mind into thinking that you're drinking something delicious that's all that you know you got to understand this is tricking the mind so your frequencies and vibrations are important because you begin to pull into this energy pull into this power and that's what super cell comes in there. all right you know like uh i had i, I had talked about it years ago when i first started you know this um this information i was saying that many of us will tap into these powers and abilities in our fight or flight syndrome all right you get into that fight or flight where you like either i'm going to fight it out or i'm going to run for my life and then all of a sudden something, something triggers within you and that 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 dormant power all of a sudden wakens up it awakens and then you're using powers and abilities that you never that you never knew you had all right so sometime it will take that situation but for the most part most of us you just put your heart and soul into this and you will find yourself in a in this hyper powerful moment of this extremely powerful energy and abilities and strength 
that are within you. And therefore, you're able to go into this extremely powerful energy. I mean, look at Andre. Andre was heavyweight. He was no built guy, but he was kind of heavyweight. All right. And he ate the way he wanted to eat. You know, he had a lot of stress going on. His son's mother was stressing him out. I mean, he just, but he, uh, an energy came about him and it's all of a sudden it just activated and he didn't know he had it. All right. Then um, you look at the, what's the one they want to call crazy. You know, you know, what's his name? Craig, I think. And what the white lady tell him, she says, you know, we knew what you, we always knew what you had. And she says, you were supposed to collect these people. So what they're doing is they collected now people and then they're sending out people out to capture others who have these extremely powerful abilities. And then they give them all these promises. Like they told Andre, you know, you, you have all the money that you want. Your son will be taken care of. You know, all you got to do is go out here and get these other people that have these powers and these abilities. Same thing with crazy. Just get these powers. You know, you can sell all the drugs you want to sell. We'll make sure that the police and the feds don't touch you at all. Just go get these other beings, get these other people, these other so-called black people that's got powers. We need you to capture them and bring them to us so that we can probe on them, so we can we can stop them from being uh, 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 in tune. We need them to not be able to freely use their powers. We need them to put in put them in these cages, and you know th this is this is where they're at. So this is why the war is being uh, 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 is being brought up. See the war. Everybody's thinking that oh the war is against with Russia and China and all that. No 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 no. The war is against us as original beings. The war is against us. And mother, because of our awakening, mother has awakened. And mother's like, you know what? I had to shut this down. I had to shut this down. And this is what they want to do. They want to they wanna put us back in a sleep state. So that they can control everything. So that they can, you know, begin to enjoy their little monetary system. They need us to be in that sleep state. Just like I told you about that one episode on uh, the cartoon um, Silver Surfer when he came across this one planetary body and everybody was playing this game and they was enjoying this game and when it came time to somebody almost winning they stopped the game and started all over again alright and they just kept doing it over and over again and when he found out that there was something there there was a system that kept all the people in this loop and he said this is a virus that's here he said this virus is not real and he said they they don't see and when they finally woke up it was the elder because he the elder first was going to fight against super so super uh, silver surfer and the um silver surfer then began to talk to the elder and the elder said, "But we, but we were playing our games and we we're having fun with these games, and 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 and, but didn't realize that there was a system there that was designed to make them stay in a loop. They were constantly in a loop and didn't know what to do. And when they finally had awakened, and the elder woke up everybody else and said, "Oh, stop, 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 stop! There, there's something here that's 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 making us think that we're having fun, that we're doing good." And when they finally opened their eyes, they saw all of their trees gone, all their precious gems gone, everything gone. And they say, well, well, who did this? And when they found out who did it, they, you know, Silver Surfer's like, you know, I'll help you to get yourself together so you can fight against these beings. And this is what's happening right now. We're starting to awaken and we're seeing that we're all our trees. We're all our um, pyramids that we built. We're, we're all of our ancient buildings where are all of our gems where are all of our crystals that we supposed to have where are all our metals and now we're starting to awaken and we're starting to see this 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 is here and this rage within us is beginning to activate that cell that that energy and now we say you know what i got to bring myself into balance Oh, no, you know, 
know, we start talking about the chants. We start talking about the meditation, the Tai Chi, like brother Marvin Jones say, you know, you, your Tai Chi, your Go Chi, all these different things that you do, you know, and what, 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 um, uh, Goku, Goku said in, in, in that one little, that one little cartoon skit, he says, your martial arts made it available, made it, uh, uh, what made it able for you to be able to do this the martial arts you tai chi you learn tai chi learn go chi learn learn these different ancient ways because this we started this it wasn't no freaking chinese and japanese that started this shit we started this long time ago they just took it from us and when we went to a sleep state they began to claim the things that belong to us so when we they so when we were in a semi-awakened state we would probably believe that but now that we in this waking state we was like wait a minute hold on this is all ours you got all this from us you obtained this from us and now we got to take it back so your martial arts your tai chi your your go chi all this this is extremely important brothers and sisters, that you be able to tap into this energy this is what about the super this is this is part two of the super cell you know understanding the power that is within you understand the energy the force frequencies the vibrations everything that's within you because now it is up to you as a brother and sister's original being to begin to bring yourself into this hyper state of information because what's coming from the cosmos what's coming from the sun information and this ancient information has just come down what is being embedded into our souls and that's why so many of us are starting to have if have knowledge of things that we said we never knew before why? Because this information is being downloaded in our system. You start feeling sleepy. What's that? That's the information being downloaded, downloaded in your system. I was getting ready to take me a nap because I'm getting ready to go to work. And um, my soul was like, nope, I got to do this video while it's on my mind because I'm not going to have the time to do it anymore. So this is what it's all about, brothers. This is that supercell, just solar plexus, charging that boy up, becoming in balance with everything around you understanding who you are i am and we're beyond gods we are literally primordial deities all right we're primordial what is primordial primordial literally means never created always been in existence that's what primordial is always been in existence so as important as the original beings that we be, uh, began to awaken that super cell all right, your breathing exercise, your solar plexus, that's your breathing exercise. Ancient, with well, that Chinese doctor, who do you think they got that shit from? They got that shit from us. When they got the monks in there and, you know, they can only hold, but they can only use but so much because they don't have a whole lot of melanin. All right, that's why they're 63 beings. They don't have a whole lot of melanin. All right, they got a little bit, just a little bit. All right. And they <laughs> all right, practice exercising the food that you eat, the things that you drink, your thoughts, the words that you speak, doing your chance, you know, astral projection. This, this all helps to charge up. I know early on when I was starting to do my astral projection, um, I was visualize myself going into the atmosphere and collecting all the energy from the atmosphere. And I saw my body in the form of a of an X and there was energy coming down to my head, my both of them to my hands and both of my feet. And and I was like my body was like that. It's like my body was like that and all that energy. And, and as I did that, I could feel that energy coming into my body physically. All right. Super cell. All right. Understand what's going on, brothers and sisters. All right. I'll catch you guys later. Just know that our enemies are watching us and this war that they're talking about. This war is brewing against us as the original beings. All right. That's what's happening right now. This war is brewing against us and they're extremely scared of who we are will become not may become not who we may become they're extremely scared of who we will become because they know who we really are all right that's why that's what like we said that's why we got all the religions and all the other garbage out there you have access to every 
type of garbage, but the real shit. All right. I catch you guys later. All power to the multi chakra celestial and jelly beans. May cash reign with you forever and ever and ever. Chaos is everything, brothers and sisters. Chaos is everything. All right. Much power to you all.